<laughs> and that's Mabel's Guide to Laughing for an Uncomfortable Amount of Time. Uh-oh, here comes more! <laughs> It's all around us, from the green of a nauseous twin brother to the weird orange of an old man's nose to the beautiful sky blue of toilet water. I'm in that one! Yes, you are, Seuss. But it wasn't always this way. According to history, the world was black and white until color was invented by a magic wizard named Crandolph the Fabulous. What's your favorite color, Gravity Falls? Hot pink. Beige! Wendy, wait, what was the question again? Lasers. Oh, or liquid metal. Does leopards count as a color? Flannel. Okay, okay. I've narrowed it down to Aurora Borealis, camouflage. Magic vision poster. None. What? I don't have a favorite color. I don't even like colors. Not even rainbows? Beats me. I've never seen a rainbow. What? <laughs> All right, guys. How can we get Grunkle Stan to see a rainbow? I need ideas, people. Sometimes if I drink expired milk, I see rainbows. I'm gonna try right now! What if we reflect the rainbow from the falls into Stan's window? Yeah! Yeah! It's fine. She does this. All right. We're about to unleash the power of the Roy G. Pivotron into Stan's office. Nothing brightens a dark room like light from a window. Time to open the window! Oh, no! Why? Why is this happening? Ta -da! <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> Oh, Mama. Maybe we overdid it a little bit. Get those bandages good and tight. I'm not giving my life savings to some quack doctor. That's it for today. Join us next week when we'll be doing Mabel's Guide to Apologizing to Your Great Uncle. I hate color more than ever! <laughs> He's just saying that. Bite my shiny metal ass. God, got it.